Well, to the latest down the search for Haley Cummings, uh, we learned investigators up in Putnam County searched a dumpster near the missing five year old's home. Uh, News 13 Sal Signs has been covering this all day and all evening for us. So all those investigators got out there to this dumpster. Uh, they did a lot of searching and unfortunately came up with nothing related to the search for the missing girl. That's right, and you know that dumpster is only about a quarter of a mile away from where Haley Cummings' home was, where she disappeared from. And now everyone was concentrated on what's on the other side of this fence right here, and that's actually those dumpsters that you were talking about, that particular dumpster. Detectives were sifting through that dumpster. They took everything that was out of that, uh, from inside that dumpster, bags, brush, uh, just a lot of leaves, everything they could find inside that dumpster. What got them there? Dogs, cadaver dogs that were brought here early in the morning. They searched from that home, particular area, all the way to where we're at right now. What happened is that those three dogs, three dogs in particular, smelled something. They caught a scent. They focused in on that particular uh, dumpster, that particular area. That's why they started searching. Detectives started searching that particular dumpster, but they came up empty, and this is what detectives had to say. Absolutely nothing of consequence was found in there. Uh, nothing of any evidentiary value, nothing that caused us to raise our suspicions any further. In fact, we're, we're abandoning the dumpster uh, as, as it is. So what happens now? Now those detectives will come back out here tomorrow with 12 units of cadaver dogs, 12 more dogs with their handlers coming back out here in this particular area. They will begin searching all over again. And of course, if they catch a scent and what we're being told by detectives is that they will search as thoroughly as they search those particular dumpsters. And of course, we'll be back out here to see if they find anything, anything at all that will lead them as to the whereabouts of five year old Haley Cummings. Greg. All right, News 13 Sal Signs reporting for us. Thank you, Sal, for your work today. Once again, if you have any information on the disappearance of five-year-old Haley Cummings, there's a picture of her right there. The number to call is 1-888-277-TIPS.